If you take a look at the numbers 5 and 4, which number is prime and which number is composite? Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science and the difference between prime and composite numbers. Let's begin by looking at the rules for prime and composite numbers. All whole numbers greater than 1 can be classified as either prime or composite numbers. Prime numbers only have two factors, 1 and itself. A composite number has other factors other than 1 and itself. So let's take a look at some examples. Let's look at 4 and 5. 4 is divisible by 1, and 4 is also divisible by 2. So 4 is a composite number. 5 is divisible by 1, but it's odd, so it's not divisible by 2 or any other number. So 5 is a prime number. So let's look at a couple numbers that are a little bit larger. Let's look at 30 and 31. 30 is divisible by 1. It's even, so this means that it's also divisible by 2. So you already know that it's a composite number, but it's also divisible by 3 and 5. So again, 30 is a composite number. 31 is divisible by 1. It's not divisible by 2 because it's odd, or 3, or any other number, so it's going to be a prime number. Okay, interesting fact. 2 is the only even prime number. Any other number that is even will be a composite number because it's divisible by 2. So in summary, prime numbers are only divisible by two numbers, one in itself. Composite numbers are divisible by other factors other than one in itself. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.